what is the life expectancy in IPF? Uh, so the answer is it's not good. Um, you know, they say two to five years. However, with the current medications, uh, it can definitely be longer. Um, the best thing to do, you know, there are IPF centers. Um, they basically will see only uh, patients with pulmonary fibrosis, meaning that, that specific center or clinic uh, will only see patients with pulmonary fibrosis um, or ILDs. It's good to kind of maybe have a consultation there every um, once a year or something like that, or at least once, um, because they may be knowing or doing things that are, that are a little bit more advanced in other places. Uh, but um, unfortunately, IPF does not carry a very good prognosis uh, if it is in, in fact IPF. However, there are many exceptions and I'll give you an example. I had a patient who was diagnosed with IPF, um, and I told him this is the, um, the expectancy, the life expectancy. So he quit his job. Uh, he said, uh, you know, I have a bucket list. I want to travel uh, through Europe. And, 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 and he did that. I think seven years later, he's still at the same uh, level and had not progressed. Uh, so I... You know, I hate to throw out numbers and, and, and make people feel like, well, this this is it. You know, you know, we should throw in the towel. I'm not one of those kind of people. Um, I'm one of those that try to fight till the end. And you know, so uh, I I think if we get bogged down with with you know certain numbers, I I, I don't think that that's really helpful. You know, what can we do? I think that that's a more um, appropriate approach uh, in this sense. So uh, I think if you are diagnosed with IPF, um, knowing, you know, um, rehab is definitely helpful. Uh, you know, a couple of these medications, OFAD, Esprit, uh, definitely are helpful. Um, you know, prevention of um, uh, exacerbations and infections is definitely helpful. Uh, so, you know, there are certain things that, that, that may be able to be done uh, to kind of prolong these things. People are now living a little bit longer. I think the initial, when we didn't really have anything before, you know, it was worse. Now it's, it's getting better. So uh, definitely look into it as far as uh, half the glass half full.